Good day, scholars, and welcome back to Writing with Miss Kitchens. Today, I am so excited because I know you have so many words on your paper to edit and revise from and to read to your partner to get more information. I'm so excited. I cannot wait for the finished product. All right. Now, I know it's a little late in the day. Miss Kitchens is just now getting on YouTube to talk about writing. It's all right because we are still able to get things done now and moving forward. So before we do that, Miss Kitchens love to go over the learning outcomes. Students will be able to include story words in their stories. Students will be able to use a partner as a tool to make writing more readable. So go grab that partner that you had yesterday and tell them, I need you to help me make my writing more readable. Students will be able to use no sight words to make writing more readable. Those, those word rings and your word cards. Make sure you have those around you as you are trying to make your writing more readable. Students will be able to use vowels to help them spell the middle of words. Ooh, that's going to be exciting to use because you all know the sounds of your vowels. A, E, I, O, and U. Students will be able to use tools such as a checklist. That's your illustrated, illustrated rubric that you have. You need to make sure you have that in front of you to check off everything, excuse me, that you've done and everything that you have not done. Okay? I'm excited about writing. All right. Have your materials with you. Have your writing folder, your pre-writings that you have already done the past two days, and your personal word ring and word cards. That is what you should have in front of you right now. And a writing utensil, preferably a pencil and your crayons. Before I go into the mini lesson, <clears throat> and that will be explained in depth what it is expected of you and your partner, I want to give you 10 full, free, non-distracting minutes of writing. This is the time where you can add more details to make your true story more juicy so that when your partner is reading it, they're like, "Woo, this story is powerful. Or if you see something that you need to fix or you want to correct within your reading and writing in your free write, I want you to also do that too. So parents, set a timer for 10 minutes for your scholars so that they are able to go in depth into their writing. And I will see you after the 10 minute mark. Good luck writing. Mm -hmm. I've been hearing some good stuff all the way over here in Miss Kitchen's house. I've been hearing you all reading those words and making those words better and free writing. Look at those pencils going across those papers. Oof, making me hot, child. Great job. I am so happy to be back. Now, this is the time for you to go off into your have to. When you are working with your partner, I want you to take a piece of paper, okay? And I want you to sit there and you're going to listen to what they are saying while they're reading your work. If it sounds readable, I want you to check, hmm, yes, this sounds readable. Or when they're finished, if they have some very valuable feedback, I want you to get that feedback down on your paper. Got to give you about two minutes to do that each partner. So, I'm sorry, two minutes together, one minute each partner. So one minute for your partner to read your work. Nope, sorry. 30 seconds for your partner to read your work. 30 seconds for your partner to give you feedback. And the same goes for you. 30 seconds for you to read your work, 30 seconds for you to say, you know what, I think I need to work on this a little bit more or I did a great job at this. After that, you want to have your rubric right next to you and you're just going to look at all of the notes that you took throughout your feedback process with your partner and you're going to look at your writing and you're just going to follow through to make sure that you hit all the areas or areas that you did not, and then you are going to take a fresh piece of paper, and that will be for tomorrow's lesson. We will start off with a whole new fresh paper to get that writing where it needs to be. If you have any questions, thoughts, or comments on how I can make this video for writing more better, parents, please comment below. Scholars, please tell your parents what it is that you want to see Miss Kitchens doing more of. 
we will be transitioning into Google Classroom on Monday. So that means that we will be more interactive with our writing. So you'll still see Miss Kitchen's face on the screen. However, I will also see your little logos happening in our class. So great day writing for day three. I will see you tomorrow for more writing. Happy Thursday. Stay safe. Stay healthy. I miss you and love you all so very much. Take care.